and it is a gigantic mural here on West 29th Street. And the painters, they're just finishing it up now. So luckily, it is still light out when we can get our first unobstructed view of this mural. And it is meant to be graphic. It's meant to make you feel uncomfortable. Parkland survivors and their families continue their work on this sad anniversary to promote their message of gun control. I've been trying to be very graphic. Manuel Oliver, this murals artist, lost his son Joaquin one year ago. We the student at Marjorie Douglas Stoneman High School was one of 17 people gunned down at the Parkland, Florida school on February 14, 2018. I need to make people understand, doesn't matter how, how much it hurts, that we have a problem. You Stole My Heart will be up for at least one month on this West 29th Street building. But that's not all the Olivers are doing to get their gun violence message out. Their group, Change the Ref, keeps their son's memory alive and works to elect lawmakers who will change gun laws. Change these politicians or these people that is not aligned in what we are looking for, which is uh, gun control. Every day I feel the same. Every day my friends feel the same. Every day it feels like the shooting is happening again or happened yesterday or will happen tomorrow. Emma Gonzalez, a Parkland survivor and leader of the March for Our Lives movement, also joined the Olivers in New York today. For me and most of my friends, we fight our trauma by fighting against gun violence. Actress and activist Susan Sarandon lent her star power as well. I do believe that we are uh, moving in the right direction. Manuel Oliver is not afraid to shock people with his art or his words. <laughs> if it means no more children will die from gun violence. As soon as we finish this press conference, I'm going to ask you all to call your kids and make sure they're okay. Because when I called my kid, he was dead. Wow, that was Allison Caden reporting just, you know, a year ago. Let's think about that. Wow. Well, well, those students have worked so hard in the course of this past year and gotten so much attention and yep. have so much support behind them. Yeah. We'll certainly continue to follow them.